2 News was first on scene of a large fire in Sepulpa sparked by a transformer explosion. And this midday, around 350 workers at the Morelia glass plant are being impacted. 2 News reporter Patricia Santos joins us live from the plant to tell us what investigators have learned so far. Patricia? Hey, well, we know that the Varelia plant has shut down operations for today. You can see crews are actually here working to repair the um, the equipment that was damaged this morning. They're also working to restore power to the entire facility. Now, our crew was first on scene this morning at around 430 when that fire broke out here. Now, take a look at the flames shooting out of the equipment outside the plant. We're told the transformer caught on fire and began to spread smoke to the inside of the facility. Initially, workers were concerned that some of the furnaces used to heat up the glass had been damaged. The manager, the plant manager, tells us today the furnaces are stable. The Sepulpa plant employs about 350 people. Everyone except for a few maintenance workers have been sent home. Now, crews continue to try and restore power to the entire facility. The manager could not give us a timeline as to when the plant will be back in operation. The Varelia plant sits along Mission Street near I-44. Three million recyclable bottles are made at this facility every day. The bottles are used for well-known beer and beverage industry brands. Now, the plant manager says it's never a good thing when operation has to stop, but in this case, they're just thankful no one was hurt. Live in Sepulpa, Patricia Santos, 2 News, works for you.